Wow, Yankee Stadium with the sun beaming down on it and the heat. It kind of gives to the ambiance, right? Check out that uh, Geico up there. My life be like. My life be like. On the right hand side, they'll give you a hard ticket. Then, baby. Yes. And check this out. Um, I'm actually going to batting practice, but right now at, at the gate, they gave me this little flag. Yankee flag. Check it out. Hold on a minute. Yankee flag. Check it out. So, follow me to right field. And let's get a ball. Shall we? As we walk down in right field, the Yankees did not take batting practice today. Why? Because they had a long trip from Washington, D.C. on the train. And they got home like, like 5 in the morning yesterday. So, I guess today batting practice is optional. So, uh, let's see what happens when Seattle gets here. I'm still waiting for Seattle to come out, but I want to take the time out and point out, even though they're not batting, there's still things you can do around Yankee Stadium, like go to the museum or take a quick peek into Monument Park over there under the black. So that's things you can do while there is no batting practice. Or just enjoy the ambiance. Finally, we get to see Ichiro. And he's warming up in right field, doing his warm-ups. I thought uh, he quit baseball and he became a special advisor with Seattle. So is he still a ball player or what? I don't think he is. So that's Ichiro warming up right there. It's like a ninja. I think anybody could do this stuff, right? Okay. It makes it look easy, doesn't it? So, we just had the batting practice. Seattle, you can see it's just left the field. Not today, I caught. Not one. And look, it's official, look. Every ball I catch, I'll show you on screen. And we got another one. All right? Got two, baby. So, just to show you, we did it at the game at Seattle. And this is living proof every ball is different. I don't make this up. Hawaiian barbecue brisket burnt ends. So we had the one from Lobel's. And Lobel's was kind of plain. But it was good brisket though. Right. But this one has macaroni salad in it. And this is burnt end. It's totally different. So, you're gonna take a bite? It's better, right? Yep. I think this might be my favorite so far. So as we uh, walk to our seats, we just finished the, the barbecue Kona, no, the Kona barbecue brisket burnt ends with, ma with macaroni sauce. Macaroni salad. Was, macaroni salad sauce, that's that sauce. But that was very good. And that's the best sandwich I think you're ever gonna find in Yankee Stadium. Wow. Absolutely. It's like, a, it's like you're in a picnic, man. Can't get no better than that. I just want to point out on video if you can see my leg. When I caught that uh, ball, I hit the I hit the uh, the cup uh, holder and I banged my knee there. Man, I've been limping ever since. Well, welcome to Yankee Stadium. Well, this is today's matchup: Gonzalez and German. He won his last one at his last start, so hopefully he gets the second one now. Let's make it two in a row. But uh, he has a good chance. Why not, right? You gotta really love Yankee Stadium when it's empty because uh, it gives it a different feel. 
It's more comfortable. You can breathe better. Look at this place. It's awesome. Actually, the, the, on the last row, the Bob Euchre seats are the best. You can feel the breeze. The only problem is you're gonna smell those garlic flies. That, I mean, garlic fries down there. Come out of that uh, exhaust vent. But other than that, it's pretty good. It's like air conditioning up here. Let's go, Yankees. There it is, Gene Carlos Stanton, Ostentonian Black. Gene Carlos, no support the Apollo, and the Yankees tied the game. Change his swing for what? Into Monument Park of the Legends. Who's back in the game now, baby? So as we watch Seattle on the field, it feels kind of empty without Robinson Cano after he got the suspension. Feels real empty without him, you know? The Seattle Mariners could be a way better team with him. But uh, that's another story. I just want to point out that the lights aren't on in the tier reserve. Only but one light over there. I don't know what happened to the lights. Will they turn it on this inning or what? I don't know, but we'll find out. Just to point that out. about that he blasted with it get him making with it he has a beautiful swing uppercut swing you're in good hands with stay farm holy cow it's another blast by Aaron Hicks and the Yankees take a five to one lead. Holy cow. Aaron Hicks. These guys are hitting bombs. He walked it off like a video game. That's what they do in MLB the show right there, baby. Made it. Made it on the top. Top right, baby. I always get that corner, man. They love me in that corner right there. Always on the, always up there. I just want to point out that still the lights are off. And it's what? Bottom of the six, right? And the lights are off up here. There's only one light on. And they're supposed to be on. So it makes it feel so much better with these lights off. I hope they keep them off for the rest of the season. My goodness. And you can even get to see the game a lot clearer. As I uh, feel Rosudo my way on out of here, it's the top of the bottom of the seventh, right? It's on top of the seventh, top of the seventh. And um, we're out of here. And uh, the Yankees are going to win this game with their winning 5-2. to two. And uh, there's nothing better than that. And today, that I caught two baseballs. The one I caught up on the key, but the other one was thrown to me by uh, Gamble from uh, Seattle. So this ball is given away already, has somebody's name on it. There's the blue mark. And uh, this ball is going to go to the big Yankee fan, Roger. And uh, I'll see you when you get here, buddy. This will be waiting for you in New York City. So uh, see you when you get here. This vlog is over. And as well, if you're a new subscriber, new viewer, doesn't cost you anything to subscribe. So please hit the like button, and you'll be uh, you'll be uh, have information on future endeavors and, uh, and whatever else I do in this goddamn channel. But this is over. So uh, see you in New York when you get here. This for you, buddy. See ya.